We have a political ad from a local Ukrainian election. And the reason why this is interesting, because that sentence has never been followed in history with anything interesting. But this time it is. Because the guy is running in a Darth Vader costume. That's it. That's the whole story. But why? Why are you doing that? So he's a member of the Internet Party. I don't even know what that is. But the even more interesting aspect of this is that basically the entire field in this uh, election in Ukraine, they're all Star Wars characters. I'm not kidding. 16 of them. It's like they're having an election on Tatooine. Chewbacca's involved. They were showing in the article about this. They were showing uh, campaign pictures with Chewbacca on the cover with a Wookiee. And they're like, yeah, vote for him because he's furry. I think the line was he'll use his furry paw to slap down corruption or something like that. Something like that. So let's watch Darth Vader's ad. Не дамо з'їсти нашого сала. Дарт Вейдер, кандидат у народні депутати від Інтернет-партії України. Окей, okay, why is there even English in the ad? That's my question. Дарт Вейдер, you can show Martin in Containo. Дарт uh, Вейдер. <laughs> why did you even add English? But, okay, in all seriousness, they have my vote. You dressed as Darth Vader, you got a lightsaber in the ground, you're sitting there playing the harp or something. Forgive me for not knowing what instrument that is. Got my vote. No, okay, here's why I wanted to talk about this. Because we did a story somewhat similar to this recently about a town somewhere in rural America where they elected a dog as the mayor. And my response to that story was, okay, ha 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 ha, it's funny, but seriously, <laughs> who's going to plow the roads when it snows? who decided how to fund some pot, fixing potholes in the street? Who's going to do the things that a mayor is usually in, involved in doing? Budgetary things and whatnot. It's funny when you uh, elect Fido until something comes up and you actually need a mayor. Now, of course, Fido's not going to actually do shit. Lassie's not going to do shit. Somebody else will do work when it comes time to do work. But I think I was stunned by it because... But don't you actually need somebody to be the mayor? You see what I mean? Like, okay, you're it's funny, but okay, seriously, how are you guys going to run the area? <laughs> and this too. Like, everybody in the uh, election is a Star Wars character. Okay, it's funny, you guys made the news, we're talking about you, but... How are you going to govern? What's going to happen? Okay, Boba Fett is a fantastic character who's in roughly three scenes, by the way, in Star Wars. Uh, but... I'm pretty sure he's not great at the democratic process. I'm pretty sure you can't really get him involved with uh, local business taxes. It's, it's I don't get it. See, this is why I'm talking about. I don't get it. It's funny. We can laugh at it. We can have fun. But at the same time, I genuinely don't know how the fuck the government is going to be run in these areas if the everybody in the race is a Star Wars character. And people are listening right now going, you're such a dork. Because we're just having fun with the story, and now you want to bring up the serious angle about how shit's going to get done. I can't get over it. I don't know how it's going to get done. You want to have one joke candidate running? Fine. Go right ahead, and we'll all have fun, and we know that person's not going to win. But when your choices are Princess Leia, Boba Fett, a Wookiee, and Darth Vader, and Darth Maul, well, I don't know who to vote for, because all you guys are joking around. So, Ukraine, I love you guys to death. I really do. I really do. I'm on your side, okay? But Vladimir Putin is knocking at your border, okay? He's right on your doorstep. He just took Crimea. He just annexed part of your country. Might want to get serious for a split second. 